Kim here. We're going, or today is November 4th. We're going to take a look at what things there are to participate in, celebrate, acknowledge on October 5th. Now, the first thing for October 5th is National Love Your Red Hair Day. And I know redheads get a lot of grief. They're called gingers, they're called soulless, they're called daywalkers. I'm trying to think of anything else I've heard of from South Park. Um, but they need to just embrace their red hair. I mean, I've seen some natural hues of red hair that were just gorgeous. Anybody would die for them. Um, and just because you have red hair doesn't make you an evil, soulless person. So embrace your red hair. And just, you know, my natural color, I've got red highlights in it naturally. So I, I have to be careful what color I color my hair or the red really comes up. Not that that's a bad thing, but it's just something I'm saying. So... The next thing for November 5th is it's Guy Fox night. Now Guy Fox tried to um he tried to explode parliament or he he had gunpowder and bombs strategically placed throughout parliament to blow it up. So, and I could be wrong here. I'm not, I'm not British. I'm not real up on that. I know I've just heard of it. And the other thing that relates to it being Guy Fox night is it's bonfire night. So everybody in the neighborhood gathers around. They have a huge bonfire where they burn um, Guy Fox and effigy. Um, so they make a big deal of it in in Britain. Don't know that they do so much here in the United States, but in Great Britain they do, and they they may in Canada. I don't know, but um, and then it's also Gunpowder Day, which would make sense with it being Guy Fox Night, and it's Gunpowder Day. And bonfire night, they would all kind of go together. Um, then it's also National Chinese Takeout Day. So whatever your, your favorite Chinese is, just come to the restaurant, place an order, go pick it up. Because that's what takeout day is, is. You actually take it out. You don't eat it at the restaurant. Um, and then there's World run day. I'm not a runner. I mean, I tried to be for a while and then I hurt myself and after I recovered, I just never could get back into it, no matter how hard I tried. It was just, my love for running was just over. Very short-lived. Um, it's zero tasking day, which I had to look that up to make sure I understood what they were talking about. And zero tasking day is a day where you give up multitasking for a day and just relax, take it easy. Um, one thing at a time, deep breaths. Oh, excuse me, it's Saturday and I can tell it's Saturday and I can tell it's not a nice sunny bright day outside. Woke up this morning and the fog was so heavy. I mean it was warm but the fog was still so heavy. Then it's American football day. So we all know what American football or those of us in America know what American football is like the NFL, high school football, college football. Um, but today is American 
football day. Because I guess all the other countries in the world call f soccer football. That is their football is soccer. Um, why? I don't know. Um, tomorrow the 5th is also Orphan Sunday. So, if you're looking to adopt, tomorrow's a great day to do it. It's, it's Orphan Sunday, so adopt. And then on the 4th, it's also my granddaughter's birthday. Whoop. Happy birthday, sweetie. Glamma loves you. Um, so I've got those things. And tomorrow, which is the 5th, I will be back and we will talk about the 6th. Okay. Have a great day. We'll see you later. Enjoy your Saturday. Bye.